Hi there Star Wars Collectors and welcome to another Bosk's Bounty video. So today we have another reveal and this time it was the previously pipelined Ahsoka 4 pack which is now named Escape from Order 66. It is an Amazon exclusive and should be available to pre-order right now if you're in the US that is. Link in the description below. If you're in the UK and you're wondering why we can't order it yet, sometimes Amazon do delay these things, but hopefully we will get a link pretty soon and I will publish that as soon as I get it. So in this video, we can take a look at all of the high-res images and I can let you know my thoughts. If you happen to enjoy it, please leave a like and let's get into this. Okay then, so this vintage collection four pack consists of four carded figures and the first one is the Ahsoka Tano and she is labeled as Siege of Mandalore on her name pill. This is pretty much a straight repack from the previous Ahsoka that we got. I believe that was VC202 from the Clone Wars. Same figure, but on a glorious card back. I've got to say, I absolutely love the image that they've chosen for this card back. What a, what a beautiful image this is. And yes, it is a repacked figure once again, but you know, they're including it in this four pack and you can kind of see why they all go together. But inevitably, it is a repack. And But as I said, that card back is just beautiful. I much prefer it to the original one, if I'm honest. And as it's a new card back, I would imagine that it would have a new number as well, if those haven't already been announced. Next up, we have R7A7, which is pretty much known as Ahsoka's astromech droid. We have had a version of this figure before, back in the Clone Wars animated line, but that figure was you know, very much animated style. You can see there that he does have the same colouring, so of course. He's kind of got that ready mauve body with the lime green flashes on there, and it's a nice looking droid. Once again, we've got the wires coming out of the feet for this builder droid, which is something that we haven't seen too often. So that's a good thing. And yeah, it's a nice looking droid, and the car back looks great. You can really see the sort of animated style on this one. And yeah, nice to have this one in the pack. Moving on to CH33P, or Cheap, as he's also known on the name pill there. And this figure is utilising a lot of the chopper figure that we've recently got in the vintage collection. You can see he's using that much shorter astromech body. Different head, so that's a newly sculpted head maybe, because obviously it's a dome-shaped head, using the same antenna on the top. And he just has the one single arm sticking out the side of his head. But I do like these smaller droids that we're getting and I wouldn't be surprised if Hasbro continue to use this mold on other figures. I can think of a few times that they might think of using that, you know, if you think of Rebels and the disguises that Chopper had, his like Imperial disguise and things like that. I could definitely see Hasbro doing something like that in the future, but the card back for this one is, you know, very nice, pretty clean, very animated once again, just showing the droid there, that's all you need. And uh, he's got like a red name pill and red panel behind the figure. But he looks pretty cool to me. So that's another one for the set. And the final figure in this four pack is RGG1 or GG as he's better known. And this is one of those sort of more cone headed type astromech droids. He's all black. A little bit of grey on the front of him there as well. But apart from that he's got some orange details on him which look pretty cool. Another great looking droid for the collection and, and as we know this whole pack is based on the final episode or episodes of the Clone Wars, hence the reason why it's been called Escape from Order 66. And you know in my opinion those last four episodes of the Clone Wars season 7 were absolutely amazing. Put all of those four together it could have been a feature film. Um, you know, an animated feature film in my opinion. So, so good. I watch it quite regularly and all four of these droids obviously feature in those episodes or at least in the final series of uh, the Clone Wars. So it's a fantastic little four pack here. I was actually quite surprised at the price if I'm honest. Looking at the price on the press release here, it says $64.99 in the US, available summer 24, but you can order it now. And this is what the press release says. It says, when Order 66 was enacted, clone Captain Rex turned on his friend and former Jedi Ahsoka Tano. But with the help of a few brave droids, Ahsoka removed clone Captain Rex inhibitor chip just in time. Fans can celebrate the legacy of Star Wars, the action adventure packed space saga from a galaxy far, far away with this premium 3.75 inch scale Star Wars The Vintage Collection Escape from Order 66 figure pack inspired by Star Wars The Clone Wars. Build on the iconic scene with the series with figures of Ahsoka Tano, Siege of Mandalore, R7A7, CH33P 
and RGG1. These figures feature premium detail and design across product and packaging inspired by the original Kenner line, as well as the entertainment inspired collector grade deco. It includes four figures and two entertainment inspired accessories. So that's all the details that you need to know from the press release. As I said, this is probably available for you to pre-order right now if you're in the US. I am working on a link for the UK. Hopefully we will be able to order that as well. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. That's what these videos are all about. I always want to know your thoughts. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you to my Patreon supporters and channel members as well. Your support means a great deal to me. So thank you so much. Thanks for watching everybody. And we shall see you on the next one.